Yo, how's it going YouTube? It's me, Dark, back with another Fortnite video. Today, I'm doing something a bit different. I don't usually use news videos, beef videos. In fact, I've never done these. But today, that changes. Today, we're talking about Mr. Wesley Snipes and Mr. Favourite Breakfast Cereal, aka Dakotes and Rhino Crunch. So if you don't know who these two are, basically, Dakotes is a Fortnite streamer slash YouTuber, and Rhino Crunch is a YouTuber, you know. That's all I have to say about them. You know, they're pretty cool, pretty good, Dakota's pretty good game, Rhino Crunch is a... Uh... Anyway, if you haven't been caught up with the new circle of these two, you've come to the right place. I'm going to catch you up with everything you need to know. And so let's start from the beginning. So, this all started when Rhino Crunch, in one of his videos, dissed Dakota's. Yeah, that, that's how this all started. H here's the clip. It's, I, I know I've been saying this for a while, but it's I, I turned it. It was like a small little tips video Now it turned into like this really great Probably one of the most game improving videos you will ever watch on YouTube For Fortnite, anyways It doesn't give stupid tips like the best types of trees to farm and you know cheese stuff like that Like I put two minutes of thought into it. This is actually one of the best most informative Fortnite videos you will ever see on YouTube.com blows the competition out of the water. Stick to streaming, brah. You know what I'm saying? This is YouTube, baby. What's that? What's that all about? Oh! That's what that's all about. Oh, this is the best tree in the game to hit, guys. That's a pro tip. <laughs> what? Why? You better stick to them bits and donations. Look like an idiot, man. It's embarrassing. I feel embarrassed for you. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm talking about, baby. You know who I'm talking about. I don't even need to say it. What's this right here? What's this? Ah. So, if you don't know what Rhino is referring to, um, he's basically referring to Dakota's pro tip video that he made a week or two ago, and then goes to just keep dissing him more. Basically, in Dakota's video, he one of his tips was to like what types of um, material to farm for the most materials, like do, what type of trees give you the most wood, and you know he just <laughs> completely just dissed him. So, what was DK's response to this? He just exposed him and took shots at him through uh, his live stream. <laughs> so yeah, luckily a lot of people got clips of this and re-uploaded it to YouTube. So here's a clip posted by Comments Only. <laughs> what if I... Okay, you know? Okay, okay. <laughs> Rhino's funny. I guess Rhino's got to diss people to stay relevant, you know what I mean? If I had 1.1 million subscribers and only like 100,000 people are watching my videos, you know, I'd try to diss people too, you know? <laughs> Ooh, burn. I don't have a big fight or anything, but the truth is, is Rhino Crunch tried to force his, he tried to force me to come out about being a Christian. He, he wanted to force me to like talk about God in my videos. You know, he said that, you know, your Fortnite's blowing up. That's God's work. And you're not talking about it. You know, you're going to go to hell. Like, I'm, I'm telling you, I got all these screenshots, man. He was telling me how, like, he's scared for me. Like, Jesus is going to strike me down or something. Like, all this stuff, bro. Like, I'm not kidding, guys. And it was like, you know, I, I, I told him. I was like, dude, I'm not going to talk about this in my videos, you know? Like, I don't want to do that. And I literally have every screenshot, every single screenshot on Discord of it. You know? And it made me uncomfortable. I didn't want to talk about this stuff. Why try to force that upon me? So Rhino said to me, and I still have all these screenshots. He said to me, he said, uh, he said, what did he say? He said, I just want to surround myself with people who are on fire for Jesus. So I will not play with you anymore, basically. And I was like, okay, like that, that's fine. And then like two weeks later, Rhino felt bad about it. He tried to apologize and say that was wrong in me, you know, but I, I honestly think that Rhino Crunch is a mastermind. I think he only wrote that stuff to cover his butt, you know? 
so he could screenshot himself. You know, he's trying to just protect himself. My boy Rhino talking like he gonna do a charity for Christmas and then trying to get <laughs> like he gonna pocket some change. Like what? The second he said that, I was like, what? No. He's like, nah, man. I don't do anything for my family. I'm murdered. Ain't so holy now. Now, here's the truth exposed. So let's recap. First of all, Rhino tried to force DK to talk about religion and God in the videos, like Rhino does. And when he refused, Rhino didn't want to play with him or talk to him because he would only play with people who talk about religion or are on fire for Jesus, as he says. So, um, why I don't know? Why? I don't know. I mean, sure, ask him to talk about it, but just because he won't, just defriend him altogether? I don't get this. But he goes into saying that Rhino wanted to do a charity stream and pocket some money for his, like, for his family. Wow, j just wow, Rhino. You're all about, like, gold and everything, and now you're trying to pocket some ch charity money. Why? Because he needed the money, and, you know, if DK, and DK does have all the screenshots, well, Rhino is pretty much dead. Now, what does Rhino have to say about this? Well, here's his response. You guys are, I know some of you are probably really anxious to hear my side of the story and uh you know maybe hear some of some confidential information i have that i that i could share and kind of expose this other person but i'm sorry to disappoint i'm not like that i don't i'm not going to take even if they're like that i'm not like that i'm not going to take confidential information and share it i don't think it's i don't think it's fair and that's just not who i am that's not my character so God bless, man. I'm sorry you're so upset. Uh, there's a reason I stopped playing with you, and you made it pretty apparent that that was a good decision. So I genuinely, like, I genuinely want to say God bless, man. Like, I hope that you find happiness, and I hope you find peace. But more importantly, I hope that God does an amazing miracle in your life, and maybe one day you can come back to this, and you can uh, you can laugh about it, or you can count it as a miracle or something. But I'm sorry, I'm not getting involved in all that toxic stuff, man. Just honestly and genuinely, from the bottom of my heart, God bless you. So basically, he doesn't expose him back. But what does surprise me is that he didn't defend himself at all. Meaning all the threat fans who are saying Dakota is lying really just got proven wrong. Either way, doesn't help his case. But so far, that's really all that's happened. But like, I don't don't get it. He just says that, God bless, God bless the Dakotas. After all he's done, he hasn't like defended himself. He hasn't said anything. He said was wrong. So, yeah, what 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 can you do? And yeah, there's there's one last clip I've got about the D Dakotas talking about Rhino, and here it is. So it kind of pushed me to the edge to where, you know what, dude, you don't deserve my secrecy anymore. I'm not going to be silent about the way you treated me. I'm not going to be silent about why you don't play with me. And everyone's going to know now because that's what you deserve. You know, I'm, I'm sitting here when people tell me why I don't play with Rhino Crunch anymore. He's literally the, my answer is because he doesn't want to play with streamers. I was trying to keep it. I was trying to keep it uh, silent. You know, you guys know me. I was saying I was saying I didn't badmouth him. I said, hey. You know, Rhino doesn't want to play with streamers anymore. So, you know what, guys, that's just the way it is. And then he came out with this, and I'm and I'm just like, you know what, dude? I'm done. Everyone's going to know the truth about you, man. Rhino Crunch is, let me tell you guys something real quick. And I'm not even hateful right now. I'm over it, right? L let me tell you something. Rhino Crunch is one of the most manipulative, evil human beings I've ever encountered in my life. I'm 31 years old. Okay, this is not like some young kid saying this. And you guys know me, man. I'm not. I'm not about that life. Rhino Crunch is the most evil, manipulative, evil, like just dirty person I've ever met in my life, guys. Honest to God. Honest to God, he is just completely an evil person to the core. Uh, the whole time I knew him, he talked smack about people. You know, I'm not going to name any names. He's just like, you know, I was awkward for me in the situations because I was friends with some of the streamers that he talked smack about. He's just so evil and hateful in his heart, you know? And, you know, it's so weird to think he thinks he preaches about he's totally not, you know what I mean? Like he preaches about these things and then like he's the other person off camera, you know what I mean? 
And I'm just done, dude. I'm done defending this guy. I'm done being his friend. The reason why he posted that video is because I don't respond to his tweets. I mean, his messages on Twitter. So calling him evil and all that. So yeah, um, just exposing him some more. But yeah, um, that's all I've got for you today. Um, if there is anything else, well, we'll just see if the DK. Or Rhino to say anything else, maybe Rhino will end up wanting to expose them. But pff, we'll see. If you did enjoy this video, leave a like, subscribe for more, join the Discord, the link is in the description, and I'll see you all in the next one. Wow.